Hi guys, HFV here. Our current location is Glasgow in Scotland and today we are traveling to Motherwell to visit the Scottish Premiership Round 25 match Motherwell against Celtic. Today's home team on the fourth place with 33 points and Celtic leading the table with 24 points more, just one point ahead of Rangers. Established in 1886, today's home side Motherwell FC have one Scottish League title two Scottish Cup titles, founded back in 1887, playing their first match in 1888, the historical club of Celtic FC are 51 times Scottish champions, 40 times Scottish Cup winners and 20 times Scottish League Cup winners. And they also have a European Cup title, which is a predecessor of the Champions League. They won that in 1967. Every single one of the last 10 head-to-head -head meetings of these two teams were a Celtic victory, which makes them clear favorites today. They also won nine out of the last 10 Scottish Premierships. But, well, football can't really predict, but they're much bigger favorites today. A few days ago, the Glasgow Derby slash the old firm was held in Glasgow. I was lucky enough to be there. A vlog in the description. Let's see some flashback. <laughs> yeah! With the result on Wednesday, when Celtic made Rangers, Celtic got on top of the league, so they are now one point ahead and they can be four points ahead as well if Rangers loses today so it's definitely a very important match for them. I was totally impressed the way Celtic played Rangers. Uh, yeah we are going to be in the away and today we are going to support Celtic today. Today's venue is Fir Park the home stadium of Madawa capacity of 13,700 people. That was the last information before we go to Madawa so let's leave. What do you think about today's game, Mike? What's the score prediction? Um, I think today maybe a 2-0 win. Uh, we've rested a couple of people, resting Jota, O'Reilly, um, bringing Bogic back. Uh, I think sometimes when you have such a good performance like we had against Rangers, uh, sometimes you drop off a level a little bit. So I'd be happy with a 2-0 win today. Motherwell can sometimes be quite tough. So yeah, happy with 2-0. Tell us about your Celtic Rangers experiences. Uh, it was wonderful, it was such a good game. Uh, I think the first half especially was honestly right up there, maybe one of the best home atmospheres, home experiences I've had in 10 years or more. Uh, so yeah, I really loved it. The first half was an amazing performance. Uh, it dropped off a little bit in the second half, but the job was done. And I think to go and beat Rangers 3-0, it was just such a statement. And yes, yeah, a real turning point for the season, I think, as well. So yeah, really happy with it gonna have to go through a pretty tight entrance here. Ah, All you predicted the correct score of the Celtic Rangers derby. Yeah. Tell us about what you think today. 4-0. Four, 4-0 four 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 nil nil for you. 4-0 Celtic. Confident again? Yeah, confident again. Ah, oh, pleasure mate. Don't fall for your three points. This stand is like the most classic British stands. Amazing here in Motherwell. It's an old style retro stadium. All of the way end here. First tier. Second tier up here. It's gonna be full soon. So it's full now. Only a few minutes needed. Prospect of a very exciting match, atmosphere wise and play wise as well. The match on the way, the away side, Celtic started the match. Celtic get into the right side. Chance for a cross. Great save.
really good chance. Abada inside the box. Keep his ball. Again, 23rd minute, many inaccuracy in the game so far. We expect better from Celtic, but Motherwell doesn't have many of the possession, many of the ball. So, uh, possibly we see some Celtic goals in the first half, but they need to be more accurate. Motherwell cross, Motherwell chance from the throw in. Keeper saves. Portuguese Jota is warming up in front of us. Chance again, shut away. What a goal! Excellent! Crowd going crazy again. Tunia Celtic. Some atmosphere here guys, what a shot, excellent goal. again on the right wing. Yeah. Three goals finish from close in. Celtic finishes Manuel in the first half. Crowd going crazy around me. Pretty difficult to hold the camera but great experience. Celtic got clinical in the second part of the first half. Excellent. the first half. Not around the Osadic 3. Sixty-five percent of the possession, seven shots, five on target, and three goals. Celtic were deadly after the 25th minute. They just got their act back together. The missed passes were corrected, and they just got the three goals. Excellent ones to really good plays. It's wrapped up pretty much, isn't it? We're going to see some goals to the closer net to see just the fans of the first tier just blow up the whole stand. I'm looking forward to it. Let's start the second half. Second half on the way, Motherwell started. Motherwell on the attack now. Really good skill. Deflected shot and really great save by Joe Hart. This time. Oh! Big chance missed. Oh! Oh!
Giacomo Marquez has been stopped off. Jota's coming in. And Matt O'Reilly came on as well. Do a chance now. Chance for Jota to get the shot away or get the pass in. Back heel. Out for a corner. Excellent save. to go to enjoy this excellent performance. Celtic free kick. Really good position. Sign it. Good technique. Motherwell Ultra stand almost empty towards the end of the match. Interesting. Big potential in this Celtic attack. Maeda inside the box. Really good ball. Two minutes of additional time. Motherwell didn't have a moment. The whole match it's one shot I can remember. Excellent skills from Chota. Out for a corner. Over in this second. What an away performance from Celtic. Didn't let in a single goal. match again guys <laughs> Celtic wins in Motherwell 4-0 and a bit later Rangers won at home 5-0 against Hearts which means Celtic at the top at position one with 60 points and Rangers just one point under them with 59 points Motherwell lost but Hibs lost as well which means Motherwell stays at position 4 it was already sure before the match. If you're a Celtic supporter, you probably know Paul the Tim. If you are not, he's the guy I interviewed about the score in the beginning. He said 4 0. And the interesting fact is that he said 3 0 for my previous Celtic log, which was against Rangers. And I mean, that guy, I swear the guy sees the future. I don't know. I mean, predicting 
two matches the exact score i hope he had a good bet on that or i don't know but that's, that's just excellent i can't believe this was my last match in scotland for now i'm soon off to the airport it was a pleasure to have you with me i mean so much love and, and so much positivity i got from you in these five days i spent here in scotland so thank you so much it's been a pleasure i hope to be back soon if you haven't seen the other vlogs from scotland yet the scotland playlist on the hfe channel is for you i hope you enjoyed this motherwell vlog as well cheers see you next time i was hfe take care goodbye